good morning dears welcome to the online class of maths i think all of you completed the works of the previous class but some of you are posted in the group but some are not anyway we can go to the next activities today first activity is savings in page number 48 i know deposited 1400 rupees in june and 1650 rupees in july her friend sanu deposited 175 rupees more than i know in june and 75 rupees less than in july find the total deposits of anu and sanu who deposited more look here Dip, june anu deposited 1400 july 1650 total 3050 But Sanu deposit in June. Sanu deposited on seventy-five rupees more than that Anu deposited. That is the deposit amount of Sanu is thousand four hundred plus one seventy-five. One seventy-five more than thousand four hundred. That is thousand five hundred seventy-five. In the month of July. Sanu deposited seventy five less than that Anu deposited in that month. Anu deposited thousand six hundred and fifty. Sanu deposited seventy five less than thousand six hundred and fifty. That is thousand six hundred and fifty minus seventy five. That is thousand five hundred and seventy five. Her total amount is equal to three thousand one hundred and fifty. So we find a total of each Anu and Sanu. Who deposited more? Sanu deposited more amount. That is thousand one hundred and fifty. Here also a side activity. Write the numbers from one to eight in the squares, but squares that that should not contain consecutive numbers so we, if we write one here then it here it is two it is adjacent if it if we if we write one here and two here three four then five six seven eight but seven and eight are come very close so you first write the numbers in some of the order then check is it correct or no here i am giving two different mothers the first e1 2 then write 3 is here and 4 is here 5 6 then 7 8 here the numbers can change therefore Here also, here the number can change, and the these two columns are interchanged. Then one, write one here, two here, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is another order. Then try to find another mother to write these numbers if you can. Okay. Then if you find some other Way, then you can write it in the notebook and post in the group. Activity is sale day and sale. See one weeks of sale at the school store. Then you have given five questions according based on this table. You can write. You can do this activity as your own. Not copy the note. Notes here day and say total in first two days two thousand forty two thousand forty plus eight hundred and sixty five. That is two thousand nine hundred and five. Total in last two days thousand eight hundred ninety plus two thousand four hundred. That is four thousand two hundred and ninety. Then total sale. This can be find in two different ways. First, add five numbers. First, write the 
five numbers according to their place values and add the total five numbers to get, we get 9220 but we if it is too difficult to add then you can uh, do in it another way that means first add the two numbers for first add the first two days total and the second two days total then one day is remaining here first add the first total and the second total we get 7195 then here one wednesday sale is remaining then add that uh, sale to this number first add the two numbers and then add the last two numbers and for the sum of the that two numbers you can add the fifth one then which day is more sale friday then the last question is write the amounts from smallest to greatest that is ascending order 8000 65 and 675 rupees more than more in august the amount spent in july is 175 less than the amount in august the amount in september is 2000 275 more than the amount in june so the amount in august and uh, september uh, depend upon amount in june and amount in july depends upon amount in august so June two thousand seven hundred twenty-five. July three thousand four hundred. Through July in June two thousand seven hundred twenty-five. But in August it is six seventy-five more than two thousand seven hundred seventy-five. That is three thousand four hundred. Then July depends upon this August. That is one seventy-five less than three thousand four hundred. That is three thousand two hundred twenty-five. In September, it depends upon June. That is two seven two thousand seven hundred twenty-five plus two seventy-five. That is three thousand. Once more, in June two thousand seven hundred twenty-five. But the second step is August. The amount in August depends upon this June. That is two thousand seven hundred twenty-five plus six seventy-five, three thousand four hundred. The in the month of July, the amount is depends upon this August. So we have say second we have find out the uh, amount in August. Then amount in August is three thousand four hundred. So in July, one seventy-five less than three thousand four hundred is three thousand two hundred twenty-five. And in September. Depends upon June. That is two seventy five more than June. That is three thousand. Which one is uh, is more more in August and uh, less in June? Here we uh, here also we have to find out the total. Here first add June and July. Then add August and uh, September. Then finally add these two. Total amount, and we get the grand total. First, add the amount of June and July. Then add the amount of August and September, and finally add these two sums to get the grand total of four months. The next activity is rice distribution. For all of five kilograms of rice will be given to each child. Three thousand six hundred kilograms in the first and thousand nine hundred kilogram in the second vehicle. So how much rice is bought total first in first vehicle three thousand four six hundred, second vehicle thousand nine hundred total five thousand five hundred. Then listen carefully. 
5000 kilograms were distributed in two days. 1000 kilograms more was given on the second day than on the first. Here you listen carefully and very carefully observe the video. Rice distributed in two days. 5000 kilograms. Second day, they distributed 1000 kilogram more than first day. What we distributed in the first day, in the second day, 1000 more than that. That means the difference between the first and second day is 1000 kg. The difference between the amount is 1000 kg. Take 1000 from total 5000 in 2 days. Take 1000 from 5000. Well, why did we take 1000? The difference is 1000. So we take 1000 from that 5000. Remaining is equal to 4000. Then we distribute this 4000 kg for 2 days equally. Each day got 2000 and 2000. First day 2000. Second day 2000, total 4000. Then also we take 1000 from that. So, first day they distributed 2000 kilogram rice. In the second day they distributed that 2000 and the remaining 1000 also. Therefore, totally 1000 plus 2000, 3000. Here check, first day 2000, second day 3000. Difference is 1000. Total 3000. First day 2000, second day 3000 and the difference is 1000. 2000 and 3000, difference is 1000. Total 2000 plus 3000, 5000. Therefore, all are coincide. Once more, total 5000 rupees. First day and second day difference is 1000 rupees. For that we take 1000 from 5000 first. And keep that 1000 in a packet. And the remaining 4000 is distributed equally for 2 days. First day 2000 and second day 2000. First day 2000 and second day we add the remaining 1000 also. Therefore, in the second day, already 2000 is here and add 1000, then 3000. Here, then the distribution is very correct. First day 2000 and second day 1000 more than that, that is 3000 and total 5000. Okay. Creativity milk distribution it is very simple. The school buys milk from the Dairy Farmer Society. How much should be paid to be society in for the two weeks together? Last week 4704 and this week 100 rupees less. So last week 4704, this week 100 is less than 4704 that is 4600 total add these two amount. So it is very simple. The, all the problems are very simple except one that is rice distribution. So, all the other pro problems you do yourself. Then check with the notes. First, you see the video very carefully and do these all the activities yourself and then check whether it is right or wrong. Then post in the group. Okay.